Hey everybody, it's Carrie from the Rapid City Public Library, your friendly neighborhood teen librarian. It's Trash Panda Treasure Box time, and if you are watching this video, then that means that you picked the Rainbow Garland for your large craft. And this one is kind of whatever you want to make of it, but let's take a look at the video, see what you got in your boxes, and uh, kind of what to do with it. What did we get in our boxes? If you picked Garland, you've got some instructions. Uh, you've got some foam dots, some silver string, clouds, and those dots, blue dots. And you can see I didn't really give you instructions, and that's because this one is a whole lot of personal taste and what looks good to you. Um, so basically, you should have dots of every single color. Some of them are glitter, some of them are not. Um, and it kind of depends. Are you an orderly person who wants to go, you know, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple? Or do you like when the rainbow colors are all mixed up? Do you want all your glitters to go together or not? Um, and then how do you want those to go with the clouds? Um, the clouds are meant to go kind of glue them together, which is the same thing we'll do with the dots. Um, you may need to trim them down just a little bit. But do you want lots of dots and then clouds? Maybe no clouds? It's totally going to be up to you and your personal preferences. But basically, you're going to take this silver string and you are going to take your glue dots and you should have enough to do um, you do one every inch if you want or you can bunch them all together and then have several inches with nothing. You're going to put one of the glue dots on one side of the foam and then take it off and then find out where you want it on that silver string and then you'll attach another foam dot on the other side. And once you have done that, they should, they're pretty much in place. I think just to kind of do an illustration here, I will go ahead and put a few on. And instead of spacing them all nicely equal distance apart, I'm going to do a whole cluster of them together. I am going to go in rainbow order. But again, that's, that's something that you, you kind of get to decide. And most of these dots should be around the same shape, uh, but it's, it's totally up to you. You can trim them down if you need to. You can even change the whole shape and make them squares or diamonds or triangles. Um, I just kind of wanted to give you the building blocks and then you can turn it into however big of a project you would like it to be. I'll use a glitter one here, just like that. And then for the clouds, like I said, they're not 100% even, so you may have to trim down some of the excess if it bothers you. Again, you can change the shapes of those too. You can turn them into dots. Um, you could make them the letters of your name, kind of whatever you guys are feeling with this. Make my, my clouds more even. And then they too can affix on that silver wire. And then uh, when you're all finished, you can hang it up above your bed or in your doorway or wherever you want, really. Just kind of wanted to do something really bright and springy because uh, it's that time of year. All right, guys, thanks for following along. I hope to see you back next month for another Trash Panda treasure subscription box. Have a good month, guys.